Have you ever wondered how to create a sketch logo reveal in After Effects? Well, in today's video, we'll learn how to create a hand-drawn sketch-style logo animation in After Effects. So without further ado, let's get started. Let's create a new composition. Name this anything you like. You can see the rest of the settings on the screen. First, import your logo. It should be a transparent PNG file. Then, I add it to the timeline and adjust its size. Next, pre-compose this layer and name it Logo Holder. Now go to Layer Auto Trace. This panel will open. Adjust the values as I've set here then click OK. You'll now get a new layer called Auto Trace. Basically, it's a white solid layer with a mask. I'll solo this layer and rename it to Stroke. I click this icon to hide the mask for now. Then I search for an effect called Stroke and simply apply it to this layer. Let's look at the settings. First, click All Masks. Then change the stroke color from here. Set the brush size to 3. And most importantly, change the paint style to transparent, so we can only see the stroke. Let's animate this stroke. Make sure your time indicator is at the first frame. Click on the end stopwatch and set the value to 0%. Then go to 3 seconds and change the end value to 100%. This gives a hand-drawn effect, but right now, it's revealing one by one. To fix this, go to the Stroke settings and uncheck Stroke sequentially. Now, each letter reveals at the same time. After that, press U to reveal the keyframes. Right now, We've got unnecessary mask keyframes, so expand the view and remove only the mask keyframes. Now we're left with only the animation keyframes. Let's convert them to Bezier keyframes. After that, close the properties and duplicate the stroke layer. Rename this one Scribble. Remove the stroke effect from it. Then go to the Effects panel and search for Scribble. Simply apply it to this layer. Once you apply it, it looks like this. Now let's adjust the settings. First, change the wiggle value to zero. This stops the wiggle. Then change Scribble Single Mask to All Masks. Check the animation. If you notice errors in your logo, go back to the settings and change Scribble using To All Masks under Modes. That should solve your problem. You can also change the Scribble color and direction if you like. There are many other options to customize the scribble style. Now let's animate the scribble lines. Set the time indicator at the first frame. Add a keyframe for the end value and set it to 0%. Then go to 3 seconds and change the end value to 100%. This will animate like sketching. Select both keyframes and Easy Ease them. Now it's time to add a background image. You can download this image using the link in the description below. Add it to the timeline, then unsolo the other layers. Go to the Effects panel and search for the Curves effect. Apply it to this image layer. Adjust the curves like this so we can bring out the texture of the image. 
Then apply a tint effect and change the white color to red. Now unsolo this layer and check the full animation. All right. Now import the transition video footage and add it to the timeline. You'll notice this video size is large, so we need to scale it down to match our logo size. Place it above the logo holder layer and change its track mat to Alpha Matte. Now select both the logo and the transition footage layers and drag them forward in the timeline, right after the stroke reveal completes. Then select both auto trace layers and change their matte mode to Alpha Inverted Matte you'll get this cool revealing look. Let's do a RAM preview. So that's how you can create a hand-drawn sketch logo reveal in After Effects.